I don't know. My favorite, my favorite thing, to, my favorite thing to do whenever I come to East Michigan is talk to Rayquaza and make him laugh. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be like, Hey Zenodo, if I spike your Rosalina once, I'm gonna make top eight at the big house. He goes, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Now, we saw this in winners finals. We did see this in winners finals. Each game was. I was on the so edge intense. of my seat. So intense. Uh, and I, just I like thought, camping, intense. Right, and I, I thought that this was going to be a very like very, very fast-paced match, but in the first game, it went from the first two stocks being taken in less than two minutes, yeah. going all the way down to a minute. Yeah, a minute left. A minute left, and that's when the game ended. Absolutely, and uh, just going back and forth, I think both of them have definitely thought of uh, some new things. Yeah. See Zenodo go getting center stage as soon as possible. Which twisting the banana, we've been seeing him do that, because if Zenodo goes for the banana, he could switch to us himself. Mm -hmm. You ever have those times where you have an argument with somebody and you're like, man, I could have said this. This is that time where they could say it again. This, it is. Like, this is like the yeah, comeback. This is, this this is, is like the comeback. Ripping, ripping the beef open you're, you're back in again. The, you're in the shower like, man, I could have said, 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 said that. I could have said that. I could have said this. I could have got a banana to down tilt it to up yeah, smash. This is his chance. Yeah, yeah, this is exactly the chance they both have. What? I love the that mix up. up. That was so I good. love it. Down tilt run away into side beat. That pivot. Yeah, it's such a... It's such a clean thing because if Salem shields like yep. he thinks something's gonna come out, he just go ahead and grab him like that. And pivoting has become just such a necessity in this game. It like has. you need to know how to pivot now. Pretty much, yeah. It's like, uh oh, down Ooh. smash. Yep. yep, yep. The break dance doesn't want to steal the up smash yet. Doesn't want to do that. And it was just a uh, clean percent to do right. it at. It was definitely not kill percent yet. Downward, so smart from Zenodo. Salem though with the banana, getting the nair. Got Zenodo in the air. See if we can capitalize on it. I feel like that's a really big thing to focus on in the match is that both players really need to make sure that whenever they go for that kill option, they the opponent has to be at the percent of kill. Because if they right. if they overextend to something like that, it might be the stock. Just We're like chilling. that, but We're Zenodo being able to and die out. It. And yep. See, uh, he, he's been getting hit one and hit three. Yep. Uh, he's not gotten the yeah, second hit. Yeah, he hasn't gotten the second hit. And every single time he's gotten. Oh, oh, no. What? The no. witch twist. That was so smart. So much better than the nair. Uh oh. Oh, the banana. Oh, oh the no. no. <laughs> the barrels. The barrels. The loop de loop. But Salem's fine. You know, he's, he's feeling a little safe since he's at 0% whenever he was hitting uh, Zenodo right. off those barrels. Those Absolutely. barrels weren't going to do any harm. That S smash is going to work on Rayquaza, but not Zenodo. Yeah. Zenodo does know how to avoid smash attacks. Yeah. He knows how to pick up the controller, press the <laughs> yeah. R button. Like. <laughs> he knows how to play with his hands on his feet. Ooh. That was so slick of him flying. Oh, the balloon right under. delayed it. The up air so, is so lucky from Zenodo. Still had the right bit. idea, yeah. though. Down tilt. Oh. Attacking out a lot up of air. Oh, oh, no. And back that back yeah. leveling the field, 76% on Salem's yeah. stock. But that's he can like definitely bring this back. That's like one, o pretty much one opening, uh, for one uh, nice combo there from Bayonetta. But oh, jumping right over the side B there. Uh oh. Salem can of course bring this back with a Bayonetta combo. It's yeah. anyone's game, honestly. Uh, game. I I'm scared. That's what's so crazy for about both Bayonetta players, is that honestly. any point in this match, yeah. Salem can just be like, you know what? I want to win this game and just do the Bayonetta. Uh oh! Oh, Ooh. the forward smash! The double monkey fist. The you double got, backhand. You've got to be at that right range in order for that F smash to connect. Zenodo taking that game. Real clean. Clap, clap, slap, slap. Shout out to Bulby. Clap, clap, clap. Slap, slap, slap. Clap, clap, clap. Somebody's even making like some crazy remix, like a trap remix of it. <laughs> Bulby, <laughs> Bulby <laughs> running so for good. Okay, <laughs> let's not talk about Bulby or Jimmy Neutron. Let's talk about Salem going against Zenodo for game two. Battlefield once again, you know, hurts Diddy in the sense that down tilt uh, up smash is gonna kill a little bit later, and also bayonetta combo is gonna kill a little bit later as well. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> that double edged sword. But this was bayonetta's pick. So maybe he's trying to worry about, because uh, Zenona's been able to close out these stocks quicker than uh, Salem has, at yep. least uh, for, uh, for the most part. And as we see, him, he's also attacking the damage. Wow. And I did say before in the last set of Winner's Finals that uh, Salem has done like shield drop stuff in his play. And the time that I saw him doing that during tournament was at Little Big House 2 on this exact stage. Yeah, battlefield. So let's see if he can uh, do that to uh -oh. actually. Oh, and then he's going to catch up oh! right here and not take and the stock. It. He said, I don't care if this is town and city or battlefield. Right. I'm going to take the stock. And he did just that. Zunoto, now, now he's the one that has to play a little bit of catch up. 
And you want to know how he got uh, Zenodo stuffed up there in that blast zone? Go ahead. He started the combo on the platform. On the platform. Yeah, exactly. Getting that higher. little extra height. Mm -hmm. Definitely uh, closing it out right there. And that's why he's uh, opted to stay on the platforms for so long, trying to force uh, Zenodo to shark with that banana. Right, right, yep. Absolutely. Now he's going to grab the banana again. Salem on the on the edge here. Uh, Zenodo not getting too close to where he can get hit, but Salem actually fighting an opening. Even yeah. though Zenodo was playing really, really safe there. Zenodo definitely looking for that down tilt uh, up smash. Ooh, Ooh if he would have waited it out, mm -hmm. might have been able to get it. Because that does start killing. And I love how not only is... Salem using Witch Twist to stop Zenodo whenever he comes up into his face. He's also using Down Tilt as well. Yes. He, he's such a, he, Salem has one of the best mix-up games I've ever seen. Mm -hmm. Oh, Witch Twist Ooh. again. Is that going to be it? No. Oh, DI, DI up and away. Yeah, that's smart. Zenodo has that SDI down. Well, his SDI is up, but he has it down. Pat. Yeah, he, has, sure. <laughs> he has it locked. Ooh, trying to get the Down Tilt. He's going to maybe throw him off stage. Yeah, yeah that's what I thought. That's what I thought. <laughs> Well, it's just gonna respect Salem's attempt to get back to the ledge. Yeah, I thought I would see the banana pluck and. Uh, I thought I was gonna see a down air. Honestly, I thought he was oh. just gonna try to take the safe option of just down airing at ledge. Oh. Oh. There's a banana! Oh, and the oh, down smash! The why? slow step too. He crawled right over. Yeah, he did. Yeah, because you can't. Of course, in run you can't down smash, and yep. up smash might not connect. So, uh, just going up. Yeah, there that was crawling. good. Yeah, but Salem doing a really good job adjusting this game. For game sure. one, Zenodo had complete control. This mm -hmm. time, Salem took that early stock and stretched out the lead as much as he could. Yeah. And we're just Ooh. playing a patient game right now. Yeah. Salem is completely fine with waiting for Zenodo to overextend and just take the stock right away. He doesn't need a bait in a combo. He just needs an up air. He's trying to bait him only using movement. He's not even throwing out any yeah. unsafe moves at all. He doesn't want to let Zenodo get any sort of room. And the monkey flip coming out. Wow, so no, no, it's just doing such a great job of getting himself out of those sticky situations, getting himself to ledge, or getting himself to center stage. Yeah. No, actually, Salem is super good at getting himself center to stage. Uh, yeah. I'll try, I'll try to point it out. See what that, that kick right there puts him at center, and mm -hmm. there he gets the stock. Great use of Nair, just finding those perfect opportunities to throw out those aerials, just catch Zeno to slip him. Again, we're here at one one. Uh, at. Grand Finals of Rebirth Nine. 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 I can read Roman numerals. Uh, uh, get what? What's the next one? Ten. No. X. X. Oh well, yeah. <laughs> that's gonna be. That's gonna be crazy. We're we gonna have a Rebirth yeah, X. That, that's, what's, that's what Vase has told me. He's like, Rebirth that, You X. know what the next one is? Like, what? Uh, like Ten. He's like X. I'm like, X. whoa. Okay, Vase says, calm down. I just need to calm down a little bit for this matchup right now because this is getting really intense. They are going back and back. They are neck and neck most of the time. And I mean, yeah, it, uh, whoever can get that first stock and extend the lead has been able right. to close out the games almost every time. Right, yeah, whoever gets that first stock kind of, it kind of paints the picture for the rest of the match. It does, yeah, absolutely. Uh, so what I want to see is for them to take the stock around the same time. That'd right. be so exciting. And then what happens is that you're just going to have two players at very high percent um, both trying to fish for that kill, and it's gonna go. It's gonna drag out for a little bit, but it's gonna be very nice tedious. Dodge, but good follow up again by Salem. But yeah, you're absolutely right. You're gonna see a lot of safe play. You're gonna see a lot of uh, just uh, patient. You're gonna see the high percentage. You're gonna see the tension. Uh oh, oh, what? <gasps> no, 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 no! Like that was so sick. That was amazing. The way he's able to just pick up on where he left off right. on the combo. That was ridiculous. Oh, yep. Calling right off of that monkey flip. Yeah, you can't just be throwing those out as as much. You know, he's reading on to him since the last set and the beginning of this set. Yeah, he is. Oh, maybe he's going to go for up smash one time? Maybe. That'd be sick. Well, Salem isn't known to do it. He might pull it out when he needs it, you know? Or maybe even down smash. Use that oh, sled and spike him right into the floor. But that's all theory right Ooh. now. All we know right now is Zenodo just took that first stock. And if our prophecy is correct, Zenodo might take this game. Yeah, that, that the prophecy, of course, being that whoever takes the first stock should take, take the, the match. Game because Zenodo's going to play really, really safe. Salem's going to try to close out that stock. But since Zenodo is uh -oh. playing... Oh! But since Zenodo is playing Diddy, he will have that advantage in neutral with Banana, and Salem will be only fishing for those kill options. Yet again, Witch Twist is also hard to land just because, uh, well, Banana, if you Witch Twist it, you don't Witch Twist Diddy Kong. Yeah. And Grab beats it. You can and just also, grab it. And also, Witch Twist 
it does decrease even if it hits just banana. Oh, no, Zeno to get out of the stretcher right. area. Yeah, even if you don't hit anything. Yep. If you throw it out. Yeah, if you just throw it out, it just makes switch time less and less. Oh! Oh! Uh. oh I can't believe And that forward throw, throw is going to put Zeno in a bad situation, but not kill him just yet. Wow, how Look is at he these recoveries. That? That's what I'm saying. Salem should be taking these stocks right. very easily. The matchup entails that, like, Diddy would have a really hard time getting back onto stage, but Zenodo's having an easy time. Living barely the bullet arts no. not going to take it because Zenodo's aware. I'm dumbfounded by he this right now. That Salem line. is doing such a good job finding all these opportunities, but the DI from Zenodo putting himself Whoa. at 181 in the grab. Pulling him right out. Zenodo, again, the same thing that Z Salem was doing last game is just putting him in a bad position just by movement, just baiting out things with his movement. Is the prophecy true? <laughs> oh! oh. Up throw? Up right, up right, my kill. Oh, the bats no! Within. Bats within. Uh-oh. See, now he can't combo with Witch Twist. He has to find some sort of stray, like neutral yep. or back air. And or that forward throw forward is throw, going yeah. to take it, yep. Even if it was tailed. Yeah, it didn't matter. 97%. Let's see if Zenodo can close out the stock and prove us true. Or prove the pros prophecy true. Or if uh, Salem can be the hero in this yeah. scenario. Yeah, honestly, we've, se we've seen him get a, uh, a full combo onto Zenodo, even though Zenodo even if it's knows. 0%. Yeah. Even if it's oh uh oh uh what? Uh, uh, what? Oh, what? I can't he, believe that. Okay, okay. Yeah, that, that that first that first man was like okay that might have made sense because maybe it was yeah, it was the something wrong weird. Side, yeah. But then he up tilted, and it still didn't hit. I, still That's I can't it. believe he got robbed. What? Man, you know no. The lucky man. The it's the prophecy. <laughs> the prop. The, the plot <laughs> armor. The That's plot what armor. saved him. I can't believe it. No no. Needs one more, one game. more game, and he will be the Midwest, the Midwest hero. He say, you know what, Ally, go take your trip, go play, go play on a stream, for uh, I'm pretty sure it's for cancer research. Yeah, Actually. it's some sort of charity. charity. Yeah, and I don't like know Oklahoma? the exact details. Uh, I don't know. Here, you know, if you guys follow Ally on Twitter, hit him up on there, figure yeah. that out. But right now, stay here for grand finals. This is Salem's tournament point right now. Zenodo's looking to just not have a reset, just trying right, to take yeah. this win and just go home. Everybody goes beat ups, have a good time. Yeah, yeah beat ups for sure. Might be on deck for Zenodo uh, if he does take this, but Salem starting off strong. Yeah, Salem's starting off very strong. Yeah, down tilt. Oh, nice shield there. Knowing that. Uh, oh, oh! Oh! Oh, and you see, he continues it with the back air. He knows he dropped it, but yep. then he picks it up every single time. That time he just gets the back air. Oh! And Salem finally deciding to throw out one of those smash attacks. <laughs> <laughs> Jumping out of your seat, man. For the first time. All right, yeah, get the banana. That's what Zenodo was actually telling me that his new thing is to get people off the stage or like uh, he's not going to pull banana most of the time in neutral. He's mostly going to try to right now. He's probably going to pull it. Yep. There it is. When he get has the that banana opening. slip, <gasps> he didn't walk forward and sail him. As he so out. close. Yeah, so close to getting that forward smash, but just not walking as far enough as he said. And you know what? That kind of whole idea with the banana reminds me of kind of doubles. Once you could oh, oh, that nice quick catch. little up air. Wow, but as I was saying, um, that quick little uh, that quick little thing where you pull the banana at the right time, it's kind of like the same thing in doubles. Whenever you get one opponent off stage, you would optimal like the the optimal choice right, in yeah. that situation is to go for the other opponent. Right. Or in this example, the banana. And, yeah, yeah. No, I did grab some. Don't overextend. Right. Just go get oh the banana. Oh my goodness. Good, but you don't need. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no! what? The hail mary up smash, just that, taking yeah, it right no, out. It was because. Salem did all that stuff with the witch twist and the aerials and stuff. Yep. Binet had such heavy landing, like he was able to just run up there yeah. and get the up smash. Uh oh. That's okay. also another reason why you gotta watch out. You gotta make sure that it's not just a kill confirm, or that it's going to kill if you go for those kill options. Because if Bayonetta lands with a witch twist like that, Zenodo's gonna get a punish. If Zenodo whiffs the down tilt up smash, Salem's gonna get a punish. Yeah, oh. Salem's gonna punish right now. Well, Zenodo has the banana in his hand, but now Salem has it. The what? banana stopped the monkey flip what? grab. Yeah, it did. Oh my goodness, Wispy. Give him a little Wispy blow, blow. just, yeah, just blowing away. Blow, blow, blow. Okay, <laughs> right. <laughs> uh -oh. oh, nice fair. Yeah. Just chipping off of that yeah, percent, yeah. As, as we said before in the winner's uh, final set, you can watch on Gucci Gaming on his YouTube channel. Uh, Zenodo does not like to go for the spike. He likes to just chip yes. on percent piece by piece and then finally go for that down tilt up smash. Yeah, it doesn't like risky play pretty much yeah. whatsoever. We've seen him get this, these clean grabs, clean bananas, everything. And have you yeah. seen Salem off stage against Zenodo? He is just furious with those nares, with those up airs, just trying to stop Zenodo at all costs. 
see if he stops him oh! here. The gun's coming out. The monkey flip, oh! he's done that before. Salem ready for it. Oh! A bear almost doing it. The gun's coming out, but making Zenoda air dodge, going, making him go to the ledge like that instead of using, using monkey flip, trying to get center stage here. Zenoda just needs one more stock right now. 143%. He's almost yeah. at max rage. Game four. Zenoda up two to one. Salem, though, in the lead this game. And Salem playing very safe. Here's Zenoda's opportunity for a rebuttal. Yeah. He's just going to oh. get that. Oh! Fine with the banana a little bit. So hold that peel. Oh, uh, the the w wispy actually uh, blown the banana away a little bit too far for Zenoda to grab it right there. Now Salem has it on top of the platform. Zenoda also going to respond. Oh! oh, he has the banana now. Uh oh, this is bad for Salem. It is. Salem Ooh. needs to find an answer. He was trying to scoop up with the witch twist, but couldn't get it right away. But if, Salem the, if the prophecy's true, oh, is Zenoda gonna prove us wrong? Is he gonna break the prophecy and hold you this can't W? Do us like that, man. You can't just you can't prove us wrong. Ooh. We're gonna look bad, the chat's gonna hate us. Right, yeah, chat's gonna chance they don't already. Us. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, don't be saying so patient. This is oh, oh, no. oh, 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 Stone oh, oh, Stone Cold. Stone Cold. Steve Austin, this man. Just chilling. So they're both chilling. Zenodo with they're the both game chilling. face. Yeah, Zenodo also always has that game face on. This boy Cap. Oh, no, he's cheesing a little bit. Look at him. See, he's such a cool guy. Ooh, stroke your beard. <laughs> Does he have a beard? I can't. I guess it's like the little. No, not Salem. Oh, Zenodo. He's got oh, yeah, Zenodo has a little. Little, little curve. Little curve. Yeah. Yeah. I think he only grew that just so, like, if someone drew him, they'd be like, oh, that's Zenodo because of the little curve. <laughs> <'Cause> <laughs> the little curve. <laughs> the, <laughs> the Zenodo hat and the curve. The hat, yeah. Yeah, the hat. You gotta have the Hell defining features. Zenodo with the curves. <laughs> Zenodo with the curves. But this is has game been. Five. A crazy, topsy, curvy, turvy, sort of, I can't even. All right, so, but this game is game five. five. Salem is looking to reset the bracket because he is coming from losers, because Zenodo took him out in winner's finals. Yes. And Zenodo's looking to just take this W, go home, get a good night's rest after just having so many matches with Salem. This is game number 10 right now in this whole bracket between them. That was the first time we really saw that extended jab from Bayonetta, and it does crazy damage, actually. And you can't actually SDI out of that. You um, if you're if you're in the middle of it, you cannot SDI out of it. If you're maybe on the edge of it, yeah, maybe okay. it draws you in. But gotcha. Uh, okay, yeah, gotcha. It's one of those. It's one of those rabbit jabs. Like, sucks like, you like, in. Fox. like DDD, DDD too. and DDD as well. Yeah. yeah. Uh, gonna look for that opportunity. It's so ooh, the fair stuffing him out. Oh, oh so, so close. close. Yeah, so are you oh, kidding me? Are you kidding me? Is that me? it? That's no gonna way. Sixty-six percent on on sales for stock. The how prophecy is looking pretty true right now. I know, but how does he always know what to do right, right after? Right. He's just so quick, and we've always we've seen so many times where Bayonetta's have been victim to just kind of staring at their opponent in wish time, not knowing what to do. But yeah. Salem, every single See, every, time, is literally ready. every time, except for that one time Sakurai decided to pull a meme. She's right. like, yeah, nah, you can't, you can't hit him right now. Bloom interrupting it right there, but yeah, it, he's so good at converting that. It's like it's like unbelievable to me. And Zenoda nope. right there converting the down tilt up smash, still not getting not a kill. Sure. Got to know those percents, you know. Maybe he just really wanted to fish for the kill, seeing he was at uh, yeah. Bayonetta was at such high percents, but he needs a little bit of rage or Bayonetta at a little bit of higher percent. <gasps> Falling, Falling right out, out of hit it. Hit one. No, yeah, not getting that Ooh. hit. The grab just so sneakily. The scoops, scoops. I love that use of afterburner kick with Zenodo already there to punish with a grab. Oh! Oh, you kidding with a banana me? Down. Oh, the up Finally. smash! Okay, okay, 46% okay. on Zenodo's stock. Only Will the prophecy 46. be true? Yeah, it's... Uh, is the prophecy true? Is Salem going to take that first stock, meaning he's going to take the match, or is Zenodo going to break that, beat Salem in neutral with Diddy Kong and his banana? And his banana. And his banana. Of course, Diddy Kong is the best character when he has his banana. Yeah, he's so he's so good. And you can hold your shield. You can wait. Try to bait someone out and throw it. Get that free uh, free grab more than likely. Wow. Oh. Twisting up there, getting that back air. Just pressuring Zenodo off stage like crazy, using the narrow oh. now. Oh! oh. What? The That's supposed, back to, be just That's stopping supposed him. to be Bayonetta's back air or, nope. or something. But Zenodo just quick. SDIing right out of that, throwing out yeah. a backer just to get himself in a good position. Oh. Snake back center stage. Now he's now Salem's in his game. Uh oh, uh -oh. Uh oh, up smash. Ooh. Oh, and that's going Sky to take it. We have a high. bracket reset at Rebirth Nine. Zenodo beat him in winners, uh, three one. Yeah. So Salem, uh, like like I mentioned before in the set.